To the best of my understanding, it looks like net neutrality has won. This is honestly very important as it, you know, forbids companies from performing all kinds of price gouging and crummy measures to screw their customers out of more and more money. And I think it's, you know, important really to put some of these multi-billion dollar multinational companies in their place. I honestly think that um, the move, you know, by the FCC to move towards net neutrality is one that, you know, quite frankly is important as it sets a precedent for the rest of the world that, you know, these price gouging, you know, undemocratic, outright, draconian ass measures, you know, quite frankly, won't be tolerated. I, you know, I'm very glad that this has happened because it means that, you know, in Australia, this is less likely to happen. I mean, Telstra is not really going to try to perform one of its price gouging, you know, it's not going to try and do the same price gouging bullshit as, you know, AT&T and Comcast ride. Right? I think that this, you know, move, you know, in favour of net neutrality is very important and it's going to improve, I think it's going to make sure that the internet doesn't become, you know, some sort of, you know, corporate plaything where a bunch of Wall Street fat cats can choose to, you know, shut down any sort of, you know, websites that, like, to effectively lag the hell out of websites that they disagree with. I think this is going to create an environment where the internet will remain free, and I think that's, you know, the move towards net neutrality, towards keeping it, is probably one of the most important victories, um, you know, of this decade. I think it's about as important as the um, blocking of the uh, SOPA Act, which would have probably... Um, downgraded the value of the internet to a point where, you know, things like YouTube wouldn't exist. In fact, I'd go as far to say that, you know, if SOPA had have existed, you know, this YouTube channel would have, you know, probably ceased to exist ages ago, as well as many of the YouTube channels like PewDiePie. I think that the move in favour of net neutrality is one of the most important moves ever made, and it's going to have an effect worldwide. And I also think that this move is really going to preserve, you know, the value of the product that, you know, ISPs, you know, companies are providing. It's going to make sure that they don't devalue, you know, what they're providing to their customer and they're not going to try and price gouge the hell out of this deregulation of sorts. Um, and that, you know, it's going to, I think that this move towards net neutrality is going to lead to, you know, ISP companies thinking twice before trying to, you know, price gouge the hell out of their customers, and it's going to lead to, it's going to keep the environment that we have now, where it's it's going to really not allow, co you know, ISP companies to accept, say, money from Google to, you know, slow down other video sites, or to basically provide themselves with an advantage. I think it's going to create a level playing field for all of these different companies, and it's going to really it's going to really just lead to a free market and I think that is just important and I think that this is the type of thing that you know we should promote in democratic societies I think that the move to net neutrality is one of the most in move to keep net neutrality I should say is one of the most important moves ever made by the government you know when it comes to issues of freedom of speech and you know freedom of information some people may disagree with me I know some an anarcho-capitalists would probably find some you know, some something in their little Bible or whatever, or if, you know, the anarchist handbook maybe to possibly throw at me, or maybe I don't understand anarch anarchism, but either way, this is an excellent move to protect the rights of the consumers, you know, from being price gouged to absolute hell. And I think it's, you know, really important to keep the internet as a free and open place of ideas, and it, you know, does put a brick wall in front of corporate-based censorships, you know, it does really protect consumers and it does protect the freedom of speech that all democratic societies must have. I think this move is important and I think that it's uh, very good that we see it, that we're seeing it now. So yeah, these are just my opinions on net neutrality and I think it's probably one of the best things to have happened in years.